All right, guys, welcome to Black Myth Wukong. The introduction is amazing. I've played it just before. Um, I can't wait to play this game with you guys. So here we go. Part one. Going to go for the whole chapter, I reckon. And let's just enjoy what this has to offer. I've been waiting for about four years, like everybody else. There's 10 million of us that bought it. It's a great game. Let's get into it. This introduction is fantastic. And let's go. So this is set after the story of Journey to the West, when the Monkey King becomes Buddha. And as you can tell straight away, how many characters in um, anime, such as Dragon Ball, has been influenced by this story from China. I was told bits of it by my auntie-in-law, who's Chinese, a long time ago. So I know bits, but there are a lot of gaps. Um, and I'm really excited to see what they do with this game. It's so epic. One monkey against everything. <laughs> I'm on my sofa, so I hope you're on your sofa too, as we go into this journey together. Safe. The scriptures. Sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain, free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. I understand that. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! That is terrifying. Ah, uh, what's his name? Is it Erlang? Erlang? Erling? I'm sorry if I had the pronunciation wrong in some of these Chinese characters' names. But I think it's Erling and his, his Black Mutt. I wonder if the Black Mutt was either, ever a, a human or... Of, ...of a different body. Because there's a lot of transformations in uh, Journey to the West. But I am no expert to the story, so I might be getting it very wrong. <laughs> Mark this. He's not just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. He's got history. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge. And they will level your mountain nonetheless. It sounds like a fair deal, of course. Hmm. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? <laughs> All these years, except for that pig, you're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good. I am entertained. 
Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours. Come at me, all of you. They gave you many chances, yet you spurn each one. Such ingratitude. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Animations on the clouds are epic. The quick dodge and... Oh, man, it's just so anime. <laughs> Boom. Fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? <laughs> for that word, all realms and beings have ruined themselves. So good. Yeah. Oh. It's just so good. It's so epic. Celestial Court welcomed you, foul monkey, yet you remain untamed. None shall save you now. <laughs> Dear brother, your edge needs homing. Good. I was in need of a back scratcher. I think the voiceover is great as well. The voice acting is, yeah, really good. Your might is with me. Who stands with you? What the? What the? Man, that was crazy. It still is crazy. Boom. No, 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 no. Skills. Immobilize. Ah, oh, parry as well with the rock solid. And the pluck of many. Go on, boys. Ah, oh, so cool. I love that.
So forgive me if I'm wrong, but that band was given to him to call him back if he causes too much trouble. Um, he gets migraines or something from it. I can't and remember so fully. Ends the last tale of Sun Wukong. A hero who treasured his freedom above all else. Buddhahood he attained, yes, but cumbersome he found the celestial rules. For he yearned to come back and to revel in the simple joys with us. Little did he know his choice to forgo the life above only fueled their mistrust. for countless days on the mountain. Since my youth, they said that his remains lie within it. <laughs> Unbegotten, undying, such is the nature of a stone monkey. Though his body was broken, his spirit endures. Into six relics he turned, and separately they escaped, choosing to stay hidden. Those are the six senses of the great sage. Yet no one has ever seen them, not in centuries. I'm old now. Venture through all the lands, I cannot. Yet among you, there might be one who is destined. One that shall recover all his scattered relics. And upon the return of the relics to Mount Tuaguo, he may yet rise again. What a great introduction, eh? Oh, my days. Oh, my goodness. We are in for a ride, ladies and gentlemen. Chapter 1, Black Cloud, Red Fire. than a home. We cheat death and ever grow. Huh? Here, yeah. you see what bliss my face well, shows. Well, well. <laughs> Luck's around the corner. Seems like he just fell from a fruit oh, yes. tree here. Perfect timing. This peach knew I needed a snack. 
I want to sprint. <laughs> A few frame rate drops, but that's okay. It actually, I'm very, very surprised with how it performs, um, especially considering. Oh, how it looks and how much animation there is and yeah i'm i'm happy with how it's running Uh, grace of gold taking us to the checkpoint have long been waiting for your arrival. Oh, his spitting image, I'd say. Up ahead is Guan Yin Temple. Once it was bustling with worshippers, before it was ruined by that fire. Ah, then the temple was rebuilt. Well, what good is it to rebuild a temple if the goodwill of men has been burnt to ashes? <laughs> You've forgotten this place, but they haven't forgotten you. Oh. It's a tough one. Good luck to you. That's deep. Yeah, let's get the DLC items. So the DLC items are can't can't actually tell what they are. We can rest. Uh, let's have a look. So we got a folk opera, arms giving armor, so moderately increases the will gained from enemies. Definitely take that. That does the same, so this is part of the same armor. That's funky. Cool. And we have a staff as well. Attack up. Yep, yep. We can do that. And we have slightly increases movement speed. And a gourd as well. Uh, when the gourd is full, the first sip replenishes, replenishes to full health. Okay. Nice. Cool. It's a nice little Kickstarter. Cool, that jump attack into the strong attack is pretty good. Um... He's fast. Let's 
sparks. Portraits uploaded. Up, up, yeah. Is that on the self advanced? Yeah. Ugh. So sparks are like soul levels, and you can just put them into skill trees. Sick. You got the smash stance, pillar stance, thrust stance. Can't get that until level twenty, level five. All right. Foundation is each. This is the stamina. Each talent level moderately reduces the stamina cost of sprinting. Each talent level moderately reduces the stamina cost of dodging. Each talent level significantly increases the engaged distance of light attack starters. Mm. Oh, that's cool. That's a yeah, that deflects arrows and stuff. That's it. Maximum health. Maximum stamina. Uh, it has to be health for now. Only 18. This game is so pretty. I will check the journal in a bit. Cause I, can, I imagine it's like an index for the enemies. Might have something to say about them. Can't go down there. Very cool. Can you break the rock? No. Making combos are quite cool. Nice. Oh, Bullguard. Our first mini boss. Well, first boss, actually, really. Um, my nose itches. I need to itch my nose. This guy. <laughs> oh, it's been a while, but the immobilized spell still works like a charm. <laughs> Since you hail from Mount Huaguo, it won't hurt to teach you a handy trick. Now, here we go. Give me your hand. 
Immobilize. A simple hand gesture can blind the enemy in place. Sick. There you go. Should you come across any miscreants, just point your finger at them and release this spell. You'll be able to hold them in place while giving yourself a breather. Sadly, mine is but a humble trick. Its power will wear off within a few short moments. Though it's good enough against boneheads like this one. Anyway, just consider it an ace up your sleeve. No! The young ones these days know no manners! Fear not! Teach them a lesson with your new spell! Ah, that's so sick. Nice. Done. Self-advanced and sparks. Open self-advanced to awaken talents. Level up to gain sparks and awaken more abilities. So let's go. Let's put some into that. Sprinting whilst charging. Seems like a good idea. Cool. And I have another one from that. Nice. Uh, perform Performing heavy attack during light attack combo with a focus point consumed allows the destined one to execute resolute strike. During Resolute Strike, the Destined One can see through the incoming enemy attacks and nullify their damage. Okay. Enemies that have been seen through are easier to stagger. So it, it doesn't... We don't take damage from their hit when we do that. That's cool. Nice. Whee, what's down here? They're frogs, and then they explode. Just gathering everything that glistens. Well, that's peaceful. And it gives you a spark as well, that's cool. Let's put it into some... Let's go to stamina. Put some into stamina. Oh, we 
got a store. You can buy some potions, some items, material. Self advance, you can reignite the spark, so reallocate the sparks from awakened talents. Cool. Just parade in, do you? It's not that simple. <sighs> Let me transform you into a golden cicada so you may follow the fires ahead and scout this mountain unnoticed. Fly! <laughs> <laughs> uh, it might be humble. But my shrine is very versatile. You'll get it soon. Yeah, this was in one of the trailers, wasn't it? That is so cool. I love this. In the depths of Black Wind Mountain, there are secrets galore. The cicada form may help you explore. A few dozen of wine. This form does not last forever. Should you find yourself lost, just follow my voice. Now, off you go. Yeah, so there is, there are invisible walls, which is okay. I mean, yeah. Elden Ring was so big. I played so much of Elden Ring that it's actually quite refreshing to have something a bit more linear. Um, I think they've done a great job at this game already. It feels very polished. Um, there's a slight frame rate issue, but it doesn't get in the way. So, yeah, they've done a really good job. I don't mind that it's not open world. I am absolutely, I'm 100% lost though. Oh, we've got a waterfall there. I uh, wonder if we can... Okay. Can we go up? No. Can we go through? No. Ah, ah, he noticed. Shit. Somehow feel like you can go through there. I don't, I don't know. I get a feeling that you can go through. Maybe not at the moment. Shit, I missed. up. Ooh, is this where we get our first boss weapon? Hmm, another monkey I see. Why don't you lay down your weapon and join me in this mercy? Oh, I will. Don't worry about that. Alright, let's go. Let's go, boy! Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, he comes back as well. 
No. Uruguay chief, Gung Gung Jai, Gung Wai. Master spoke of you. Ooh, red tides. As the feral flurry intensifies, with each fierce thrust, the flames do rise. Transform into Wolf Guai and inflict Scorch Bane on the enemy with each attack. Bangin! We got our first transformation. Uh, weapons and valuables cherished by Yorguais often carry lingering obsessions from their deceased owners. Collecting them grants the ability to briefly take on their forms in combat. Each transformation has its own strengths, making them worth experimenting with. Transformations continuously consume might and require a full gauge to initiate. Okay, so the yeah, it's going to deplete once you've transformed. And when it does deplete, you go back to monkey. And... Then it replenishes itself. Cool. What's this? Ring the bell. What would happen if I rang the bell? One way to find out. You just had to make some noise, did you? Now everyone knows you're here. That's not a bad thing. I'm so grand echoes in the forest. Yao Guais will surely be alarmed. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Anything this way? Just, just a dead end. Evil repelling medicament, tiny piece of gold. Is it just why is it just there anyway yeah he's whining what are you big head he's got a big head king has 
Uh, such a pretty game. Been up here. Ah, incense burner, nice. Yep, that's what we want. We want to rest. Fill a stance. Pillar stance. Switching to pillar stance is up on the D-pad. Allows the destined one to support himself with his staff and ascend to its top. We're holding heavy attack, that's wicked. Avoiding ground attacks in the process. The more focus point he builds, the higher he perches. If the status staff is hit by the enemy while perching, more stamina will be consumed to maintain balance. Hmm. That sounds wicked. I don't think I'm ready for that yet. Maybe immobilize? Immobilize is cool. Or maybe we should do each talent significantly increases. The engage distance. That sounds that sounds good. Grants more focus when the second move of light. Okay. That sounds good too. Let's do those. Because we use light attacks a lot, so it'll be silly not to improve that. Nice, got another one as well. What can we do with that one? Uh, what's this? After sprinting, light attack starter temporary deals more damage. I'm, these light at lighter attacks are probably wise because they're the ones that we do the most. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Right, let's um let's take on this bad boy and see what happens. Ooh, frame rate, come on. We have finally met our match. What about this one? That damage negation, I think it is. Ooh. Oh, that dodge is so good. Oh, I smacked him in the face. And again. Get down. Oh, 
Oh, come on, stamina. That came at a good time. Wandering white. Sick. Ooh, that was cool. Cat's eyes beads. What? Slightly increases critical hit chance. Yeah. Cannot switch weapons or armor in current status. Oh. Oh, because I'm. Oh, it's because I'm this guy. Uh. De transform. What is this? Cannot absorb spirits without guidance. What does that mean? Well, hopefully I can come back and get it. Now I can equip it. This is moody. This is moody. Hopefully I can get guidance at some point to go back and get that, that thing. In the backyard is Black Wind Gwai's ally. Calls itself Ling Schutzer. Considering your strength, I suggest you get away while you can, little monkey. Okay, let's go. If I rest, do I lose that spirit, though? Craft armor. Oh, hello. Uh, allows using the gourd while sprinting. I don't know. I don't know. Not sure. Each talent level slightly increases the health recovery upon consuming a focus point. Okay. And then that's given us what? What's this? Incre increases maximum focus points from one to two. Nice. Okie dokie. This game is bugging out. Oh, is this from the trailer as well? Oh, yeah. Hello, hello. Damn. Damn, you are fluffy.
games, huh? The animations are so nice. Smashed him. Yogwai King. Yogwai King. He down. 